Gamers here. We're here today in Hirschfelden. This is our first time in this map, and we've also got a new species to hunt. What is it, Aiden? Um, geese and deer. <laughs> okay, we're going to be hunting some geese today, and the Canadian uh, goose to be exact. And we've also, well, Aiden wants to look for some deer too. And it's kind of ironic in two ways that uh, this just came out uh, a few days ago. The first is uh, that the last few days, the sound of the Canadian geese flying over has become a very familiar sound around here. Um, as they've been migrating back uh, from down south um, and heading north to Canada, I presume, and uh, a lot of them, of course, do summer around here in Minnesota and Wisconsin. So we've had a few landing, and actually today, Aiden and I um, got some on video. I was out uh, just doing a little walking around the property here with the rifle, and uh, had, had a couple Canadian geese land in the field, and I'll show some uh, footage of that here in a little bit. Getting back, uh, I also asked for the... Uh, this type of, uh, of of species in my last video uh, when I was out hunting mallard I said this is uh, the next thing we need is Canadian geese now and we've got to uh, got to have a good blind to hunt them in out in the field and so here we are and uh, now we're able to go ahead and do that I will went ahead and already uh, we'll jump into the map I went ahead and um, already put out my blind because I can't carry all the gear uh, at once unfortunately there's quite a bit so we've got it placed just a little ways out in the field we're currently at this location here I'll jump over to the inventory and we'll take a look at what I'm carrying today let's go down to our uh, oh collars we've got those these uh, these are our decoys and we can have 24 of them there's three different styles um, I've got a little bit of of all of them We've got six of uh, of this style with the neck bent. We've got a few more with the neck up, and a few more with the. It looks like it's eaten there. So, got a few a few different of each there. So 24 total. Um, and then I've also got the flag here. This is also new, the flag lure, and it kind of is supposed to flap. I guess it'll be interesting to see that in action. And then, like I said, our blind is specific for field in uh, Hirschfelden here, and I will uh, we'll see that, of course, when we get out there. We're going to be hunting today with the 20 gauge, um, and we're also going to be taking our trusty 12 gauge over and under out. Uh, and then, of course, we've got our calls up here with the uh, long range and the short range. I'm really excited. It, the uh, the Canadian goose makes a very pretty call and like I said we've been hearing plenty of it around here the last few days and so I'm excited to see what those sound like. And uh, and then the clothing again carrying the fall um, for this map. Basically I decided not to uh, equip Aiden with it right now because it is mainly for forest in this map not for field so much. Uh, according to the description, and so I'm waiting to find out if they actually do come out with a uh, field version, and I'll buy that for him as well as myself. Uh, so, you know, we're not made of money around here. So, um, he's got his 12 gauge there that he'll be hunting with, and he's also going to be bringing a deer rifle, and I equipped him with the Boone and Crockett camo, uh, because uh, just in case if a deer comes along. So, well, let's head on out, bud. You ready? Um, that's just a run. Oh yeah, you want to run? Normally, as uh, any of you know that play this game, running is a bad idea, but I do run out to the blind. Uh, because I'm not run. even... <laughs> oh, okay. You forgot how, huh? There you go. Right. It's been a few weeks. Gosh, I don't even know the last time that he was in here playing. We've been playing... A lot of other stuff, some Firefall, a little bit of Planet Side, and uh, just just been real busy. Aiden hasn't had much time to play lately. Nope. Let's go ahead and pull open our map here. I'm going to yeah. mark down that blind. I know that we're heading in that general direction, but... Heavy. Yeah, so we got our new PCs built. Getting stuck on the rock. Come on down, bud. Right there. 
<laughs> wow, that's awesome. So Aiden is now gaming on my uh, old PC. I hate calling that thing old. Um, if you saw some of my videos, part one of the PC building, um, you'll see that system being built. And part two is actually getting rendered tonight and will be uploaded probably before this video. And so uh, part two is me building my new one. And I can't give away any any secrets of the new hardware you have to see the video and we'll be talking about that later with the decision on what graphics card and things like that um, of course I went with an Intel i7 I always use Intel for my own PC builds and Core i7 also how do we spy up here come on over here bud <laughs> still kinda looking for deer once in a while you'll run into a few but I, I mainly like to uh, get out to the, the blind as quick as possible. It is 6 o'clock, uh, at least when we spawned in, 6 a.m. And weather's looking good. Hi. So we've got spring springing around here. Been trying to get outside more. Like I said tonight, I grabbed the rifle. Uh, just grabbed my air rifle. Uh, left all the gunpowder at home today. And I uh, just went for a walk, and like I said, I got down in the field, and a couple of uh, Canadian geese flew in. And uh, I think we're right up here. A couple of Canadian geese flew in, and uh, I, I luckily had my camera with me. I do apologize. I'm going to show some footage, but I uh, my camera is uh, it's a decent. It's HD, but it was zoomed all the way in 53 times zoom, and uh, which is the max. And, uh, you know, trying to hold it steady and all that. We've got an animal out here. Can you stop, please? Oh, okay. You goofball. Uh. Running around like a chicken with his head cut off. Alright, oh. I think you're gone. Yeah, why don't you, um, why don't you pull up your scope and see what it is? Pull up your gun here with the scope. Yeah. Uh, you be oh, pull up the uh, other mouse button. Let's just have a look here. Uh, let me see what that is. I don't mind shooting, uh... You see it? No. There it is. What do you got out there? Oh, oh. It's, a f it's a pheasant. Oh, it's a pheasant. Yeah, he's got a pheasant out there. Alright, go ahead and, uh, don't shoot. Can't shoot it with that deer rifle, so get your shotgun uh, out. Alright. I'm actually going to get my 12 gauge. But jumping ahead with the uh, the the geese there, I recorded them, and then uh, we happened to have a couple deer. Uh, actually, we had five deer come in while I was uh, recording the the geese that came out of the woods, and I recorded that. And uh, we also got a whitetail. Uh, taking a dump. I've never been able to record a whitetail pooping, and uh, maybe you guys will be interested in seeing that. And so we'll show that here in just a few minutes. And we've got a couple pheasants out here, but we need to w wait for them to, to fly. So let's uh, just go ahead and flush them out. I see Get you ready. Die. Get ready. Zoom in on your shotgun. Get ready. Yeah, it's way too far away. Oh no. Get your uh, get your shotgun out. Don't use your rifle. That is not gonna do you no good in here. Look at this. You, you, you watch the pheasant. Watch if it. Don't shoot it now. Don't shoot it now. Gotta let it take off. Gotta let it take off. And you whistle. <laughs> Boom. Oh. You know, I don't know if this is even the first pheasant I've ever took. It's been I I usually don't never would shoot at him in Logger's Point, but we'll find out in a second. I think I've used a bow on to shoot at a couple. I don't know if I actually hit him, but uh yeah, look at that. It's my first pheasant. I'll be darned. I never wanted to shoot him or hunt him in uh in Logger's Point, because I'm always in there looking for deer. Yes, you got in the blind. That's that's good. 
And so, there we go. We got a pheasant. Lots of pheasants out here. We are going to do a pheasant hunting video. That was my next planned video, and then all of a sudden the geese came along here, and so we're kind of hopping on that since it's brand new. I'm going to go ahead and get all of our decoys uh, set up out here. And uh, need to go into my inventory and dump them all in. And uh, then we can go ahead and start putting them down. So we're going to scatter them all over around our blind and just kind of make them look natural. While I'm doing this, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the little clip there of the geese and the deer that we had just outside of our... Uh, again, that was literally uh, just outside my door here. That's kind of the view that I have from my computer, so I'm, I'm pretty lucky to be able to sit here and hunt on my PC and look out and, and see that kind of stuff. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I just gave you a little sneak peek. I'm probably going to edit the entire uh, thing. They were here for 25 minutes, uh, the geese were. And I'll uh, probably end up uploading it just as a second video for anybody who's interested in that. We'll definitely be upgrading some of the camera equipment here, you know, hopefully sometime this year by this fall. And I'll be doing a lot more shooting with the camera as well as some gun action here once hunting season rolls around. So what I've got in my hand here is not my golf club. We're not out here golfing. This is the flag, the Canadian uh, Goose, Canada Goose flag. And honestly, I don't really have a clue what I'm supposed to do with it. So you just wave it like that. <laughs> oh, heavens, this is interesting. 
Oh. So we can like crouch down in here and uh, and just wave it. Oh, look at that! We got geese already flying over. Aiden, get your shotgun ready. Ready? Shoot! Shoot him! Shoot him! <gasps> I got one! I got nice. one! Nice! I got another one! Oh man! I hit that one. I saw some feathers flying there, but uh. I got. Hey, how do you do this? You need to. Yeah, don't don't lay down. So wow, we just had a lot of shooting right there. I just had a big shot and it and it and it and it gets you fall right down. So I think uh, boy, there's so much going on. Suddenly, I wasn't expecting all of them to come in. Um, I think Aiden might have hit that one over there. He got his first goose, I think, uh, before I even did. Good job, buddy. Man, I'm really good at showing this. Yeah, you are. And then press your space bar to stand. Uh, yeah, we'll be quick. We already, everybody knows we're here. Press your space bar. There you go. Poor kid, he's in about eight different games, and he, he starts not remembering uh, which uh, controls. Go over there and get that one. Yep. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah, Press your tab key and get your uh, hunter made out. Alright. And so let's go ahead and collect our goose here. Wow. Okay. I hit it in the neck. And I have no idea on that score. This is not mine. And take a look at Aiden's here. Alright, buddy. That's a nice one. I'm going to take a picture. Yeah. And we'll jump out of there. Okay, let's go. Let's get back in there so we can get some more more goose shooting. Look at that. These things are just flying over like crazy. It seems like these things are, are just, you know, so much more frequent than the mallard is. So come on into the blind here and uh, get crouched down. You can run to get in. I guess these are gonna pass. Go ahead and and uh, go over in that corner, and I'll go over in this on this corner, so we don't end up having problems shooting. Yeah. Go to the opposite corner. Oh. Yeah, back there. There you go. Yeah. So I got the 20 gauge here, but uh, I'm I'm a much bigger fan of the uh, 12. And look at that, we got more flying over. Oh, uh, get ready. Here's the man. Let's try to. Get your oh. call out and call them. Get your uh, number five, your blue. Here they come. They're landing. Oh, he's just shooting them already. Yeah, I think you missed that one. Hit reload. No, they're too far away. Don't shoot no more. Yeah, hit reload. <laughs> His little four-year-old mind is going 100 miles an hour here. No, no, I guess... Get our call out. Yeah, go ahead and get your call. Let's hear what they sound like. This isn't going to be a hardcore goose hunting video. Like I said, this is our first time. So this is a short range call here. He just blew the long. Nice. <laughs> they are such a pretty s sound that they make. Yeah. That one, that one, this one is like a doggy. <laughs> Sounds like a dog. Um, blow this one too. So that's the long range. That's the one you want to be blowing right now. So you blow that one, and when they get close, switch to the blue one, the short range. And uh, I guess I'll just wave my flag over here. It's like, hey guys, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Does that look funny, bud? <laughs> Alright. I guess that uh, worked well to entertain him. Hey. What a goofball. So, yep, you got your call. Now we, uh, we're not prepared and all these geese are flying over and Let's keep on calling them, bud. So I imagine you wouldn't use this until they're flying over. 
which would be kind of hard to to do them all here, but I guess that's uh, seven for me. I guess what you'd want to do is start out doing a long range until you can get them in range. Once you see them flying over, you should switch to the short to get them to uh, break off of the of their flight pattern when they're high up and then you know get come down within range and then I imagine at that point once you have their attention you'll wave your flag of s surrender it's kinda funny and uh... and then do your shooting hey daddy, daddy, I have a different, I have the, why don't you ha do their continent I do their flag <laughs> we'll have to get you a flag he doesn't he's got the two calls but we don't have him a flag but I'll definitely get you a flag Cause that would be a, uh, I don't know, doing trying to do all three. This kind of thing here is it's kind of different. <laughs> yeah, it's like I'm holding an umbrella. Could come in handy. Holy cow! Yeah, it's great to be in this map. Like I said, I never intended on it to be so long. Uh, uh, that that we never came to do a video in here. I, I think I'm missing Whiteheart Island also, but uh, we'll get we'll get over there as well. I I love this map because it's fall. The only thing I don't like about it is there's no whitetail. It's the uh, whatever red deer, roe deer, all the other business that's over here uh, that's common, I guess, in Europe uh, since this is supposed to be Germany, I believe. And uh, that's just weird for me. That's uh, it's very weird. And I come over here, and it's this is what hunting looks like to me. And and uh, the fact that there's no whitetail, it kills me. So I'm hoping we get a map in the U.S. here soon. That's in the fall setting. Here they come. All right. Yep. Blow that call. Blow that call. Blow that call. Hurry up. Well, now they're already within range. You need to blow the long range, bud. You, there you go. Now blow this one. And... I'm gonna switch over to seven. Get your shotgun ready. Get your shotgun ready. Here they come. Right there. Shoot. Shoot them up. Oh, are you kidding me? I missed. I missed two. I got one. There we go. Nice job, bud. I did two. Oh. All right, that's that good. One. That's good. Now that's I gotta get my uh, get my shooting back here. I haven't touched uh, this game in uh, too long. <laughs> you got a space to stand up. He gets all confused on that. All right. Alrighty. Now let's see what I have. Yeah, we got at least three down. Uh, why don't you go over there and collect those two quick? Uh, I guess this is mine. Oh man, shooting geese is a lot of fun. This is uh, one that I hit here. Uh, how did this one? This is not my. You gotta get your hunter made out. And I think I think that one might be mine again. I'm not sure. Yep. Want me to take it here? Go get the other one. Oh, he. So I hit it and he finished it. Oh, that's a nice one too. So I harvested it for him. He got the kill shot. Good job, buddy. Getting uh, getting showed up by my uh, my four year old here. Ah, and then he he hit this one, and then uh, and then I finished it off. So Aiden got the big guy so far, huh? See, I'm back in a bind. Oh, okay. Yeah, you might as well stay in there since you're wearing uh, wearing camo made for deer hunting, but uh, that's okay. And if they don't come out with a fall field, because this is fall forest, if they don't come out with fall field camo, um. I'll go ahead and I'll be getting them this here, but I'm gonna wait a few weeks because last time 
they came out with the swamp one a few weeks after. Uh, I think about two weeks. Okay. So okay. now we're back at it. Why don't you get your long range call out? Alrighty. Here I go. Uh, and yeah. then uh, why don't you get back and uh, go in that corner there. Yeah. Go in the other corner. I'll go in the other corner. Over there. Uh, yep. Yeah. You can get up to three guys in these blinds. But it's important to stay apart because when you get your shotgun out and you're, you're shooting like this, if I try to shoot right here, it may very well not let me and uh, y you'll get a lot of shots screwed up if you're right next to each other. Don't, don't shoot me! <laughs> that is right. We don't point guns at each other, do we? No. Alright. You only point guns at whatever you wish to destroy and that's it. Okay. Now that we've got our hunter safety lesson out of the way, um, yeah. I got my umbrella again. No. <laughs> These things seem like so much easier to uh, to hunt. I mean, there's just so so many of them, and they're big, and I gotta at least get like a, you know, I gotta at least get like a double kill with my 12 gauge. And I'd like to get a triple kill again with my with my 20 gauge. I got a double kill, ba boom, like that with it in my duck hunting. I think uh, in episode nine. Daddy, 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 can you see what number two does? Number two uh, on your keyboard does nothing. I have we use our mouse uh, thumb button. Uh, there's two of them for our two guns, and so one and two actually are not used for anything at this point but uh, it's just the way I like it I'm, I'm um, you know, more or less used to that because my first person games I know that when I hit my front mouse button uh, thumb button it's always going to give me my weapon my main weapon and my secondary in this case you know I'm just carrying two shotguns today but I would normally carry the uh, bow in, in this number two spot and uh, my deer rifle here all right, let's get to do some calling here, huh? I have the, I have the, you get the, I have the, you get the blue one now, this, this, and then I get the, uh, I get the range. <laughs> here they come, here they come. Okay, I hear them. No. Blow your long range. Okay. If you want to do the blue one, that's fine. Yeah, I want to do the blue one. Just, uh, we got to... Here they come, they're behind you. They're over here. Man, I hope he reloaded his shotgun. Why don't you get your shotgun out and... Oh, good. He's doing it. Here we go. Alright, here we go. We gotta call him in, gotta call him in, but... I didn't... I didn't do that correctly. I should have gotten him the... Got to use that long range to call them in, to break them off, and we didn't do it. Well, there is one over here. We don't want to shoot at one one goose, though, so let's just let him. Oh, we got two. You think we could take them, bud? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna take them. Just let him let him circle around here. Oh boy. Well, he we landed out there. We don't want to shoot him on the ground. Nah. Let's go ahead and let's try to call in some more here. Yeah. That one's going to be our little buddy out there. Aiden sure had a ball watching watching those geese. He's never seen them uh, before. And uh, I don't even recall if I ever saw any fly through Tennessee or not. I'm, they might migrate through there, but um, I don't really actually know where they go when they migrate. Down to Texas, Mexico, I have no idea. Down to the Gulf is what I believe, uh, but which would Tennessee would be in their path, but I just didn't, didn't recall if I did see them, it was when they were flying. I'd never see them landing. There's not much water in, in Tennessee. So I've really missed seeing these for the past, uh, well, we were there for eight years, and uh, the other day, you know, it was the day before they released the geese on here, um, 
I heard them flying over our place here when I was outside and it just oh it made me feel so good and happy to be back again and uh, I've never hunted a hunted them in real life but I do plan to change that this year this fall I will be laying out in the field just feet from my office here and uh, <laughs> doing a little goose hunting Hey, we'll go do some farming. Hey, I'm glad you brought that up. For those of you that are always asking about my farming, I am seriously trying to get that done. It is. I am going to definitely be running a lot more episodes or chore logs. With the... Uh, that was nice. That was in sync with the uh, farming videos. Uh, but uh, just been getting everything set up around here and so busy with different things. And to make up for it, I am uh, and I have been streaming lots of Farm Simulator on Twitch. Everything that I'm pretty much doing between chore logs, I am streaming it on Twitch. And uh, I am going to get a schedule for for this game also. Uh, for you guys so you can tune in and catch different games at different uh, different times and some random stuff in in between but we are gonna be definitely um, bringing out some some farm simulator and uh, it it was my next video up however uh, we've jumped in and cheated with another uh, episode here for the hunter but uh, that will be coming we, we have one right here. Right I know. Here. Yeah, he was supposed to help us draw some more in. They sure do look lifelike. All right. I'm not going to shoot it. We don't want to shoot that on the ground. Uh, in fact, I know with pheasant, when you shoot pheasant on the ground, and that's primarily why I never bothered shooting them, and that's why it was my first one today, is that uh, the pheasants, when you shoot them on the ground, I don't think they go into the trophy. I could be wrong, but I, I don't think they go into your trophy... Uh, when you ground shoot them, they got to be airborne. So I've just kind of left them because I'm mostly uh, been bow hunting and you know trying to hit one of those with a bow in midair is probably difficult. Okay, I hear some coming, so let's uh, get our yeah here they come. Let's get down, get your short range call number five. Hit number five. All right. Let's get these guys to break off. I see them, I see them, I see them. Yep, yep. We gotta get, don't shoot, don't shoot yet. Don't shoot yet. We gotta get them to break off. We'll wave our flag. Hey guys. <laughs> Alright, get your shotgun ready. Come on, put the flag away. Oh my gosh. Ready? You ready, Aiden? Uh huh. Ready? Uh huh. Oh my gosh. I tried to shoot and we're colliding with each other here. Okay, where's more here? There we go. Man, Aiden dropped one. Man, is he good. It's on fire. Those are kind of far away. Hold on, hold on. You're not going to hit them. This one up here is uh, is going to be outside range as well. Yeah, nice. No, that one's out of range. Don't, don't, don't do it. Don't do it, bud. You're just wasting ammo and, and making more racket. Uh, Alright. I can go out there and collect them. Just stay in there for a minute. Alright. I'll collect them. Gotta get my guy running here. So, th I know I got here, too. Let's see what we got. Oh, that's a pretty nice one. 5,000, I guess. The other ones were four, and Aiden got one that was, uh was five and let's run on over here I think this is the one that that he dropped oh, check, check, that out. check it out oh it is man oh he got seven thousand this kid is just killing the big guys today look at that what an awesome awesome goose you shot buddy yeah yeah that's how he's <laughs> doing in the fire station yep he is killing the big ones. I guess I'm going to be getting the small pickings today. See what we got here. Oh, there's my big one. Holy cow. Might have to do a trophy shot. Yeah. 
You want to come out here for a little picture time, bud? Uh, yeah, how about you turn up, though? Come on out and we'll do a picture. Jeez! Oh, what I missed! Alright, we gotta get into our, uh, little blind here. We got some geese flying over right now, messing the whole program up. Oh, but I can't tear up. You coming, yes. bud? Too bad we don't have a roof on this thing. Stupid rain shower. Why don't you go back in that corner and I'll go right here. Oh, okay. Now, lean down. Make sure you're reloaded. I'm gonna go with the uh, 20 gauge this time around. Go back uh, a little bit farther. Go in that corner. Yep. Go right over there. Right. All the way back. All the way back. There you go. Now, uh, let's take the, uh, the, 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 the orange one. The brown one. Well, we got nothing else to do besides get wet right now, so we might as well call some geese. And hope that the rain goes away. Yep. Oh, we got some that just flew over. Here, get your shotgun ready. See if we can nail these. Are you gonna take... Uh, uh, he didn't get it in time. Just let those two land here. And uh, there'll be some some live decoys. We should be good with this rain going away. Why don't you, yeah, we probably just use your long range right now because, uh, there is none around here that we care about. Those two there probably won't fly away. On most of these calls, you're not supposed to, like, overdo them, but anybody that's been around these geese knows just how much they really do yak. Here's some more, I think, coming. There's a pheasant we just heard. That was kind of nice to see some pheasant in here. Alright. Uh, can you stick your friend out? Yeah, we will. <laughs> Don't worry, bud. Yeah, we'll have to definitely get in and do some pheasant hunting. There's the flock over here. Always flying a nice V. I wonder how they pick the goose that goes in the in the in the front if he's the one with the best navigation or how they do that. But they're always in perfect formation. Just gotta keep calling, bud. We'll get some over. Where did the real ones go? We got all these decoys out there. Oh, there he is. Yeah. Let's see if I can spot him. I'm not gonna shoot, but... Boom! We gotta get them when they're in the air. We could whistle right now and it would take off and uh... and we could shoot them, but uh... kinda waiting for a big flock to come. Aiden, do you see the uh... the other one? There was two. Yeah, we need to get a blind that is uh, waterproof. And well, I only see the one. Yeah. Well, I'll whistle if you want to take a crack at it. Yeah. Get your gun ready. Get your gun ready. Okay. Yeah, space bar, remember? And uh, aim your gun at it. Don't shoot it till he flies, though. Get your gun ready. Don't shoot till he flies. Okay, I'm gonna whistle. Ready? He's gonna go. Just, just let him fly. Now shoot. There you go. <laughs> I think that counted. I think that counted. I'm gonna go look at it. 
Yep, go pick it up. This kid's gonna make me look bad with all his uh, trophies here, probably. I didn't get your cat. Huh. <laughs> Oh look, I'll get it for you. That's a 6,000 there, so bringing in some big boys. I don't know how high they go. Maybe 10? But we stay out here long enough and we'll probably find out. Come on in and we'll crouch down. Let's let's uh, make sure you reload your gun too. Yep. I thought there was two that landed. I don't know whatever happened to the other one. Oh, there goes a flock. Little one. Why don't you go back in that corner and I'll stay back in this one. And you are supposed to kneel down in, in here. I was just standing up there and in the... Goose didn't seem to ma uh, mind it, but... Yep. Go I was just looking at, at his confirmed kills. He's got four, and I actually have six. Uh, which surprises me. I thought he took a few more than me, but... Um, that's ten that we've gotten so far. That's not too bad. We'll probably get a couple more. At least get a dozen, right? Get a dozen? Maybe a baker's dozen? You want to get six? Well, you better drop two of them when you see them. Then <laughs> tomorrow I want to go in here and I just want to shoot. Oh, yeah. I got my blind still sitting at uh, Rigaroo Bayou. Rigaroo Bayou. Yeah, it's not going to show up on here. I don't even remember. It's uh, out here in the marsh area. And I've popped in a few times and done a little bit of mallard hunting and and uh, even streamed it on Twitch one day. Oh, here we go. Get your blue call. Number five. Get number five ready. Alright, get your shotgun ready. Ready? Oh, come on. Three for three for crying out loud. <laughs> I got one. Good job. Uh, yeah, I, I doubt we'll get those. <laughs> oh, we can't Just had to, had to do that. Uh, uh, you don't check mine. And I will add some more here. I don't know who got what here. Let me run around and collect them. If you want to keep calling, we'll get some more. Alright, this one, uh, this one, uh, was Ruger, so Aiden got that one. That was nice. I'm paying a binding. Yep, Call yep. That sounds good. I got the, the right camo for the job here. Well, for now. I'm sure they're gonna come out with a field, field camo. And here's one of mine. Okay. This will be so cool. Yeah. And another one. Oh, that's a little one. <laughs> it's a little one. Yeah, th these ones were a little bit. Alright. I hope there's nothing I'm leaving here. What? I tried for three, but uh, couldn't couldn't get her done. I can't turn up. All hey, right. what are you doing out here? There's our pheasant tracks. Are you going back in? Yep. <coughs> All right, get in and crouch down. Let's uh, call in a couple more here. Yep. <laughs> you want to stay? Go back in that corner. I'll stay over here. Yeah. I should get him uh, his own blind, and I actually intended to do it, and then. And then uh, now I would have had to buy him too, so. Yeah. It's 
spent all that money on PC hardware. I am using finally a solid state drive and oh my goodness is that so much better. Um, before, you know, uh, I was using a Western uh, Western Digital Black, you know, one terabyte, which is a very good hard drive. 64 meg cache, you know, but uh, nothing beats the solid state. You're talking about this one, about 525, uh, uh, the uh, what is it? The read speed versus like um, 150 on a traditional hard drive. So lots of good stuff. I was having trouble with this game uh, opening the map before. Like when I did that right there, it would take 20 seconds, and uh, I think there might have been also a little problem that I had in my game file. But it's been a nice change. It's kind of funny. Uh, I am thinking about getting a webcam also set up. Um, you know, record us. It's just a little bit challenging trying to get both of us in the same webcam. But uh, it's kind of funny to to watch him sometimes when we're switching games all the time, and he kind of forgets the keys a little bit, and uh, he just it just gets this blank stare uh, at the keyboard trying to figure out you know wh which key to be hitting, but. Uh, He's getting better. He's been playing now for, well, you know, over a year, but he's been playing and doing videos with me now since uh, about six, seven, nine months. Hey, look at that. Yeah, we need to get the other collar. Oh, let's just get the shotgun. Get the shotgun ready. Oh, shoot. Oh. Oh, I don't know who got that. Aiden, I was hoping you weren't going to shoot right there because uh, those other birds went too too low. Oh well. Stay in there and uh, whoop. Let me reload. Yeah. See who 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 got it here. Ooh, that's a nice big one there. I don't know if he must have not hit it, so or else I hit it and killed it, and then he hit it again, and uh, didn't register that one. But I still want to get my three for three. I don't know. We'll come back and do some big time, big time uh, goose hunting here one day. Okay, here's here's our. Let's make this a good one here. We got four coming in. Let's see if we can five. Let's see if we can get them all. Nice, Aiden. Okay, get your shotgun ready. Get it out. Ready? Ready? Let's go. Oh, shoot. We're close. We're too close. Hold on. Come on. Shoot him. Shoot him. <laughs> right here's one. Oh, come on. Had to reload at the worst time. Well, that didn't work. Uh, the little problem we had there was uh, we were sitting on top of each other, and I saw his gun barrel, and I... Oh, look at this, a pheasant! That's a hen. Shoot it! <laughs> I was trying to let him take it, but... Uh, nobody's going to get that one now. Yeah. Was a yeah. That was a rooster that I shot earlier, and I, that was a hen there. So decided to pass on that. I think these are both mine, bud. Go back in the in the blind and get your call. Long range. We gotta we gotta get one more. Oh wow! There's a nice one there. Too bad it's raining to do a little trophy shot there. Eight thousand. Jeez. Okay, yeah. I'll be right back. Alright, buddy. Go back in the blind. Hey, goofball. Alright, let's see what we can call in here. We got a couple more that are just coming in. Let's see if we can get these. Oh, man. That's a lot of shooting. Alright, they're too far. Don't re reload your weapon. Yeah, reload. Right. 
Oh, he's only got two more, two more bullets. Um, yeah, that didn't work out. Here's a couple more coming. Let's try to call him down. Let's try to call him down. Just stay in there. Stay in there. Don't shoot yet. Don't shoot yet. Right. Whoops. Don't shoot yet. Come on down. No, these aren't going to break off. Aiden's not uh, crouching and I'm outside. and Let's Just crouch. Just crouch down in there. Yep. I gotta see about getting him some more ammo. That's a pretty good one there. I already have two more ammo. But yeah. But, 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 I don't have more ammo though. Wait, go into your inventory. Get another box there, bud. There you go. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's see what we can get called in now. Yep. Whoops. Not gonna call it in with a flag. You sit in that corner and I'll stay here. Let's have one more good run here. And, and that's the one to farm in. Yeah, and yeah. I don't know about that tonight, bud. I got some subscribers that would certainly uh, like that, but we'll be we'll be getting that next. No, no, I want to get yeah, yeah, goose. Yeah, and another thing that we should be doing is also standing up. That definitely helps a whole lot when uh, when you decide to go ahead and engage them. You might as well have a better line of sight too. So here, here's some come. Switch to your short range call now. You almost don't even need that flag. Probably work works better than maybe the short range. I don't know. Okay, these ones are coming in. Get your shotgun. Not yet. Do not shoot. I'll tell you when. Alright. Um. Let him circle around. Okay. <coughs> Alright, Aiden. Let's, uh, not yet, not yet, hey. not yet. Okay, stand up. Let's engage him. Let's engage him. Oh, I'm missing here. Oh, I'm you gotta be very precise with this tw uh, 20 gauge. Oh, I'm in goes. Mm. The first one there, I could see... Hey, hey! He didn't that goes. I was gonna try to call him back in, but that's just not gonna not gonna work. Boy, we can't just get one goose. That's no way to finish it. Yeah, I hit this one twice. Like I said, that twenty gauge, I I just. And you'll see me talking about it in my uh, 20 gauge video. Um, it, it's just the semi-automatic thing is not not really my style so much. But uh, in a 12 gauge, yes, or even better yet, give us a 10 gauge. Um, I hit that one twice, and I I noticed I felt really bad when I did that video because I thought, man, I missed a lot of shots, but. Um, I actually hit a lot of those mallard in that video, and it just wasn't enough to bring them down. And I've been noticing, whoops, not what I wanted to push. Uh, I've been noticing that I've been seeing the actual hits on on some of these, uh, uh, you know, geese today with the 20 gauge, and, and it's not bringing them down. And by the time I get that second shot, they're they're a little bit too far out. There's a flock over there. I don't know if they're coming this way, but we could try to call them. Yeah. Best we can do. So, I'm a big 12 gauge fan uh, with, with the power in here. It seems a lot easier, but I think that 20 gauge would be really delightful, though, with the pheasant. Maybe they're a little bit closer. You're flushing them out. And, uh, definitely will get the job done. And it, uh, it is kind of a must have because it's the only gun like it we have so far. And I have tried out the um, the uh, side by uh, side by side uh, 12 gauge. I just don't like that thick profile. I really like the uh, you know the more thin profile of of this gun here. The nice little bead. Um, you're basically looking down a big 
two big tubes of steel with that other one and it's uh i don't know it just seems like uh, it's a little more distracting when i'm trying to follow uh, a bird or something through the air <laughs> we're making all kind of noise aren't we yeah that's quick together one two three yeah <laughs> Did you do yours? Oh, he's doing that one. Doing the blue. Yeah. <laughs> he loves having his call, that's for sure. Well, it seems like an eternity. We finally got a couple more to fly over. Dealing with a big rainstorm. All right, let's see what we can do. Let him circle around. Let him circle around. Are you ready to take him, Aiden? You ready? Okay, yes. let's go. Got one. Good job. Right, let's see if I can get a couple of these over here. Yeah. There's a couple more. And I think this guy might be within range. There we go. Nice. Boom! Whoop! <laughs> Man, that looks like a wrap, huh? I got one too. Yes, you did. We got we got stuff down all over. We got uh, two out there, one there. I lost track of how many I brought down right there. A couple more flying away. You coming with me then? Okay, let's see what uh, one we got here. Oh, that's a nice one. That's another nice one. And we got... Oh, here's a couple. Whoop. I ran out of ammo from my 20 gauge. I don't know if those are in range or not. Nope. <laughs> yeah, I didn't, I didn't think they were. They're really far out there. Taking pot shots at them. Okay. Yeah, it got a quarter after nine already, and it really has slowed down quite a bit, so I'd recommend getting in here, uh, preferably about, you know, five, six. We, we went in at six and, uh, and hunting them, because there were a lot more of them this morning. Kind of like uh, real life. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, and this one uh, is one that you had hit. Okay. I ended up bringing the kill down for that one and we've got three more out there that was pretty good haul in I don't know if we got any more over there you said you think you just you brought one down yeah okay and that one uh, another one holy cow and I hit it he hit it we really drilled that thing What you got over here, bud? And there's there's yours. Nice. So All right. So I saw that two of those. Now we're fired. Now look look at look at uh, look at me for a second here. Yeah. So he's got uh, he's got six, and I've brought down. And it says nineteen. Holy cow. I didn't realize I brought that many of them down. Just make sure we don't have any more over here. Yes, the afternoons are not going to be probably the greatest uh, to spawn in and uh, until late afternoon, I'm sure. But haven't actually gone in and verified that myself since this is the first time that we have hunted the Canadian geese or Canada goose. And uh, why don't you come out of there, bud? We actually don't need to be in there no more. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to be done. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, again, I will most likely be adding that um, uh, remainder of the video of the deer and the uh, Canadian geese in, in real life here uh, that I shot earlier this evening. I'll uh, probably upload them for whoever's interested. They'll be out, uh, imagine, you know, after this video. 
And uh, I'll be working pretty hard to get out and do some more filming of, uh, of you know, more stuff going on around here and, and animals. And uh, we've definitely, I can promise you, have got some shooting vids coming. Um, I am going to be getting out. We've got lost a lot of our snow outside, so we're going to get digging in on that. And uh, my 45 is just itching, itching to throw some lead. So we've got some things to shoot up, and uh, probably get the uh, get the Ruger SR9C. <laughs> so we got uh, got that one. I haven't shot in uh, in about a year. It's been a long time since I've put some lead through that one too. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And, uh, you know, let me know if uh, there's something you guys want to see us hunting in here more than others. But uh, we're going to be switching it up. I'm not sure what we're going to do next. We might bust out a pheasant video, maybe some more goose. we got to hone our skills and see what we can do. But uh, anyway, any, uh, any last words, Aiden? No, it's probably pretty much about it. <laughs> Got some more geese coming and we're almost out of ammo. But I hope you guys enjoy it. And until next time, take care. <laughs>